Uh, you had a lady already that said, hey, uh, set up some dates. I uh, want to go for a helicopter ride. Yep, yep, yeah, exactly. So, yeah, so, yeah, take it, take it, take it easy, guys. Hey, guys, welcome to our video series with client Jean-Francis here. Welcome, Jean-Francis. Thank you. So, you've been doing well. So far, so good. <laughs> yes, yes. Good. So, this video is called Don't Raise the Bar Too Fast and Why. What do you think? Uh, yeah, well, if you raise the bar too fast, you, you sabotage yourself <laughs> from personal experience. You need to, yeah, you need to keep keep things slow, you know, honestly, uh, slower than I'm used to. I think I mentioned before, you know, in Canada, usually, or, or the U.S. when I was dating, it was like instant. Uh, the instant quality, raising the bar? Yeah, 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 yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, 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 boom, boom, boom. And here you need to, you need to just... Give some room. Give the lady some room and you know, give it some time. You do. <laughs> it's very different. Yeah, we have this expression in our culture, of course, don't raise the bar too fast. And here, uh, the thing is, guys, if you raise the bar, if you come in and with a high bar, you know, there's only one direction to go and that's up. <laughs> right? Or down. Yeah, up or crash and burn. I'm just saying, once you come in here, you can't be dating her and dropping the bar. No, exactly. uh, the only way you're dropping the bar is when you crash and burn. So, yeah, and you had a you had a lady already that said, "Hey, uh, set up some dates. I uh, want to go for a helicopter ride." Yep, yep, yeah, exactly. So, yeah, so yeah, take it, take it, take it easy, guys. <laughs> don't don't start with the boom. I'm taking you to Louis Vuitton and buying you a five thousand dollar bag because it's going to only go up from there. <laughs> it's an exaggeration, an extreme example, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, in fact, I would say that you know, raising the bar is one of our shit tests. Okay. You know, uh, let's face it, in the dating trenches, everywhere in the world, we're both shit testing each other, right? Women are doing it, guys are doing it. And it's, it's, it's basically a technique to get to know somebody quickly, right? Because let's face it, we're not getting younger. Uh, so <laughs> the goal is to decide yay or nay uh, quickly and move yep. ahead. Yeah, and yeah. Cut and release if that's the case. So yeah, don't raise the bar too quickly. Take it slow, especially in Ukraine. Lots of opportunists, gold diggers here. Depends on the pond you're fishing in, though. If you're yeah. fishing in the Tinder pond or uh, free dating sites ponds, then it's uh, yeah, loaded with gold diggers. Yeah. So and especially especially the really young ladies, you know. And I, I would say any like model like beautiful woman under 25 it's red flag red flag red flag <laughs> okay just red flag Definitely. Uh, especially if she starts uh, if she's saying let's go to this restaurant or let's go to this banya or let's go to this spa and everything like that and then you, you it's like really really high amounts of money like it, it, you need to say bye it, it's okay yes it's great to have this beautiful 20 something year old like, you know like flirting with you but do you really want to be spending thousands of dollars and then boom just crash and burn not, not a good idea. Expensive. You can't do that too many times. <laughs> no. So stay tuned for part two with Jean Francis Q and A here coming at you soon. <laughs>